You know, Steve, look, I think the market's trying to find a level that it's comfortable with. We had a fairly large rally at the end of last quarter as people anticipated good earnings in the quarter. I think we're getting the good earnings. We've seen 10 years move up. We've seen it sort of settle in this three, three and a quarter range. I'm not saying we're in a sustained three, three and a quarter range, but I think there's a lot of news in the market. There's a lot of details and traders right now are trying to find a sort of a, a I'll use a great word, a neutral level. Uh, we can come back to that <laughs> idea of neutral level in a minute. No, um, when you look at the 10 year at 317, is that uh, is that going higher in your opinion? I think it's going higher, but I think that if you look at the Fed and what they've done on their forecast and what they're telegraphing to you, there is probably one more rate increase this year. Look at the dots next year. I'm not completely sure that the Fed's going to meet their targets for next year on the dots. Uh, but I think if I were sitting in Jerome Powell's seat, I would have put out the three dots for next year as well to give himself the latitude to move rates if the labor market continues to tighten and we see inflation come through the system, both in commodity wa commodities and wages. So in your mind, do you have a price in your head or a, sorry, a rate in your head for where Fed funds go over this cycle? How high do they go? And what happens to the tenure in response to that? Look, you know, everyone wants to talk about the, 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 the normal rate for, for, for where we are. Um, you know, we're two, two and a quarter now. Could we get a, a Fed funds rate to 3%? Does that seem sort of normal to me? And, and, and am I smart enough to say it's exactly 3%? It's somewhere two and three quarters, three, right. maybe three and a quarter sounds like the, the area. You know, we all knew what an ease, easing period looked like. We knew that zero to zero and negative rates was a very easy period. And the Fed clearly stayed there longer. They clearly wanted to put liquidity into the system. The Fed clearly wants to take it out now, and I think that's what they're doing. But I also understand that they want to do it in a methodical basis, and they want to be very transparent. So, you know, I think we'll gravitate to the high twos, maybe low threes. What happens, I know you like to look at individual stocks, but what about the stock market in that context? A 3% funds rate, the 10 year is going to be somewhere over that. Yep. Is that a bad environment for no, stocks? I think it's a good environment. So if we have a, if we have a, a three percent Fed rate and we funds rate and we have a you know three and a half plus ten year rate let's let's call it three and a half we have a fifty basis point spread in there and we continue to see the economy grow we continue to see earnings grow we continue to see companies invest in the labor force and we continue to see wages grow I think that's a great environment for us to live in.